Hello there, kids. It is I, Stray Cat, the one and only, coming to you with a vlog because, oh boy, there has been some things going on. There has been a quite a backdrop of crazy drama shenanigans going on in the Let's Play field. So, of course, I, being the nosy fuck that I am, have to put my nose in it. Hmm. Okay, so where do I start? A Let's Player who, quite frankly, I wasn't really fond of. Uh, I tried watching his content, just didn't really hook me in any particular way. Um, has, in a wild, wild state of events, um, has cheated on his wife, actual still wife at the time, uh, with the ex-wife of another uh, animator slash let's player uh, of a group that I actually do watch, uh, Game Grumps, uh, Ross O'Donovan. Uh, his ex-wife, Holly, or Commander Holly, um, was uh, an accessory, I guess we could call it, to pro Jared's cheating. Uh, special in its own way. And of course the alleged underage pictures from Tumblr, which given Tumblr's past history I'm not really surprised about. Um, that's not really looking good either, and that's a whole different kettle of fish of crazy, um, really jackassetry on Jared's part, but the main point I'm trying to make is on Heidi here, so let's backtrack to uh, the main problem here. There's just a lot to unpack here, and I don't think I can do it justice. Um, <laughs> Pro Jared's shenanigans outside of his marriage, I guess they were married at the time, um, on Tumblr, I was somewhat aware of. Um, I had friends within Pro Jared's circle that apparently were, if not aware of it, or if not participating in it, rather, uh, were aware of it in some way, shape, or form. Uh, apparently, it was before it snowballed into the thing it became that uh, became a detriment to the marriage before the eventual cheating came out. But uh, I was aware of it, and I didn't think nothing of it, mainly because I didn't know he was married. Uh, had I known he was married, I would have been a little questioning in that regard. Um, not saying that there's anything wrong with that as long as there's permission given. Explicit permission for that going on. Um, didn't sound like that was happening at all. Uh, sounded like a lot of things were going at the behest of him and not the wife. Now ex-wife. Um, there's, there's, there's a lot of things, a lot of things to unpack. Oh boy. Um, I feel I should say, as someone who experimented with a polyamorous relationship, uh, that communication, trust, and, quite frankly, permissions, uh, specifically, are very key. Very key to success. And if that was what he was trying to do, in a roundabout way, he failed miserably. Um, if that wasn't what he was doing, and he was just having fun, uh, just excluding the wife in that, that's doubly fucked up. But, um, there's, there's so much to unpack. Oh, good gods. Oh, jeez. Uh... Quite frankly, 
He deserves more than what he's getting. He is losing subscribers, uh, followers, uh, his influence in general. Uh, <laughs> he deserves far worse than that, honestly. And if uh, the rumors are to be believed, there are actual investigations possibly going into his conduct and behavior, which is probably a good thing, uh, in my eyes, uh, especially if it uh, uncovers actual evidence uh, behind these allegations of minors sending allegedly fairly solicited nudes to him as he shared them back from the sound of it. Uh, there is a lot, a lot, a lot wrong with that. Boy, oh boy, oh boy. Mm. Blood is boiling. Let's move on. Because that's fucked up on its own. Apparently the wife, the ex-wife of Pro Jared uh, has had this happen before. I'm assuming uh, that's at least how it's sounding like to me. Um, or at least has been through divorce before for reasons as of yet, I don't know. Uh, I'm not too deep into the rabbit hole yet, but uh, doing this to someone who's already been divorced had a relationship that didn't work out. Uh, and having it be your fault for making it not work out is not a good look for you as a person. Um, quite frankly, uh, <laughs> I was... I don't know. I don't know how to term it, uh, I guess, not surprised that this sort of thing came out about him, given I knew in a realm of influence that this was going on in a way, just not knowing that he was married at the time, and then learning about it afterwards, that put it in a real bad light. Then to find out that it was with ex-wife of another Let's Player who him I enjoy as well, but the group he's in I enjoy immensely. Um, that's even more bad light looking, especially since they divorced, well, the second couple in this wild, wild story. Uh, had divorced fairly recently. Um, that doesn't look really good at all, either. Very, very much not good at all. Paints her in a very bad light as well, because it takes two to tango, or in this case, horizontal tango. And, uh... Mm. Another statement she made before her Twitter got put on protected does not really look good either. Um, it looked very two-faced in particular. Uh, I'm going to hope I can pull up the tweet in some way, shape, or form. Uh, like I said, her tweets are protected as of right now. There's not a lot of ways I can do that currently, but uh, I'll, if I can, I'll post it here. If not, eh. Uh, believe me, it's out there. Uh, her statement being, I'm sorry this is happening to you. I'm here for you. Or something to that effect. This part, of course, being to the husband, Pro Jared, who she was fucking at the time. I, uh... Hmm. 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 That 
is not a statement to make when you're one of the parties at fault. It isn't at all. That's besides the point. The point I'm trying to make here is that this is wildly, wildly not what I expected out of this year and out of a let's play sphere of influence, for lack of a better phrase, of some content that I enjoy. Um, I don't know what to say about uh, how Ross is feeling, how Heidi, the ex-wife, I keep referring to her as uh, the ex-wife, but I really should be using her name, Heidi. Um, there's just so much going wrong. So much going wrong. And uh, I, I hope for the best for those two. Because this is wildly insane stuff to be wrapped up in. Um, and to Holly and Pro Jared, I can only hope the worst for you. Because you two have done very, very fucked up things uh, to Heidi in particular. Uh, acting like a two-faced person to a woman you know was married to the guy you were fucking. Pro Jared doing his thing, allegedly also with underage fans of his. That part I wasn't aware of, but that is... Mmm. Mmm. So special. There's just so many things wrong with this entire situation. And it's one of those things that I feel... I guess I should weigh in on. Because it's in the Let's Play sphere unfortunately, and it is tied to a group I enjoy, unfortunately. And I feel as a man, because the man is the majority of the fault here in this particular situation, I feel as a man I need to call it out as an egregious offense to your wife, to those who cared about you, not to mention a complete offense to the people you essentially used for your own self-gratification, including, from the sound of it, minors, allegedly, which really makes me wish harm upon you, but I'm assuming the universe is going to take care of that for me. Because it makes you look like a cunt. It makes you look like a super selfish cunt who deserves nothing of what you have. Quite frankly, in my personal opinion, I hope you lose everything that you have built up since you started doing this. Because, quite frankly, this is egregious. This is fucked up. I have nothing more to say other than I hope the worst for you. Holly is a special case where... She just kind of said the most fucked up thing possible for the situation, given that she was part of the situation. But I feel bad for her in that she's probably, hopefully, she's probably more or less innocent in this due to the fact that this was just something she threw herself into to try to make herself feel better after the divorce for whatever reasons they happened. I'm not trying to excuse any of the actions that happened. But I'm just trying to give her the benefit of the doubt here. Pro Jared, not so much. He knows what he did was wrong. He's doing damage control to the best of his ability. Quite frankly, I don't feel that he should get to have damage control. Quite frankly, I think he deserves to lose everything he's built up.
because this is the most fucked up thing you could have possibly done. Especially if you tack on the nudes he essentially solicited from minors. Allegedly. Even though I know for a fact this was an open secret on his Tumblr and in his sphere of influence. So it wasn't just a mild secret. It was a relatively open secret. I have no doubt that this might have happened. It wouldn't surprise me if more people started coming out with these stories. From the sound of it, there are plenty already. And I believe all of them. And that's my take on it. There you go. Ah. Other drama I'm not going to talk about. The James, Charles, whatever the fuck's going on in that sphere. I don't know enough to really weigh in on it, nor do I care to. But this is a realm that I reside in, so I felt I had to say something. Especially because I have been cheated on in more relationships than I care to count. And quite frankly, it pisses me off more than anything to see other people do it. And just seemingly not care. Even as they are clearly at fault for every single step. Anyway, that's my take on it. I will get back to the normal gaming videos in just a moment, or an hour, somewhere in that ballpark, but I just wanted to take the moment to say, fuck you, Pro Jared. Fuck you. Wow, I haven't done a video like this since Michael Strickland and his laughing at liberals bullshit, which he's out of jail now, as far as I'm aware. Uh, he deserved his jail time. I think he deserved more than what he got, but eh. Uh, waving a gun at a group of protesters with five mags of ammo on his person because self-defense apparently means prepping for war, uh, <laughs> or at least close enough with a pistol. Uh, but still, nonetheless, that is um, unnecessary and not to mention fucked up, but that's a whole different video. But uh, for now, I think I'm just going to end this with Thank you all so much for watching. Click the subscribe button if you like these videos and you want to see more. Click the like button if you like this particular video. And share in comments. We can bring more people into this community. We can talk about how fucked up Pro Jared is and other people. I'm pretty sure we can find some more. And I'll see you all in the next video. Shout out to SVS on YouTube and Raj Kamal on Patreon for supporting my Patreon and thus supporting the channel. I very much appreciate it. Although I don't think you technically supported this video. Or at least you, were, you weren't supporting for this particular video. And this was a freebie. You're welcome. This has been the one the only stray cat playing games, vlogging, and ranting about motherfuckers doing fucked up shit. And, uh, yeah, that's pretty much it. This video was nothing but ranting for you.